Welcome to your free video lesson from Teach You Comp Incorporated. Be sure to check out your exclusive discount offer at the end of your free lesson. With the color replacement tool, you can replace an original color in an image with the foreground color. The color replacement tool provides an artistic advantage in that it preserves all of the tones in the image. You can change the sampling methods, limits, and tolerance settings to control the range of colors that Photoshop changes in your image. To use this tool, select it from the toolbox, which shares a spot with the brush and pencil tools. We'll go over to our toolbox, right-click on the pencil tool, and give the color replacement tool a left click. Now up in the options bar, under brush settings, we set your diameter and hardness from the drop-down menu here. We're going to change this red handle of this paintbrush to a different color. So we're going to decrease the diameter just a little bit. That seems pretty good. After you've made that selection, then we'll click out of here. We can look in the rest of the options bar. We can select a blending mode here. We have color, which it defaults to, hue, which is similar in colors, saturation, which is used to convert to grayscale, or luminosity. We're going to leave it selected at color. Next, you'll need to select your sampling method, and that's using these three buttons here in the options bar. With these, you can select continuous, which samples continuously as you drag your mouse, once for one click, or the third one is background swatch, which will only replace color matching your background color. After that, using the drop down, you'll want to set your limits. You can set them to discontiguous, which will replace the sampled color wherever it appears under the pointer, contiguous, which replaces colors that are adjacent to the color under the pointer, or find edges, which attempts to find those natural edges in your image. And we'll leave it for now on contiguous. The tolerance setting, located right here, is used to set how similar the pixels you select should be to the other colors in the image. A lower percentage changes colors very similar to the ones you select. The higher percentage changes a broader range of colors. So we'll just select we'll say 70% right now. Click out of there. Finally, selecting the anti-alias checkbox right here gives a smoother edge to the areas that you change. Once you set all of your options, you select the color that you want to change as the foreground color. So we'll go down here and we will select a nice blue color and select OK. Then you just click and drag over your image to replace the color. Remember that you can zoom in and out for more precise precision, if needed, as you make your color replacement. So let's try this. We'll click into the red that we want to change and start to drag, and we'll see what that will do. Now depending on where you have your settings set, you may run into trouble. What I mean by that is right now we have our, our tolerance set at 70. Let's just see what happens if we lower that down into the 10% range. In that case, when we drag out here, we're a changing pixels that we really don't want to change. So you have to be very careful with your settings. Let's go back. We'll open our history panel. And we'll just delete out what we've done here. Then go ahead and close that out. We'll change our tolerance back to 70 because that seemed like that was really working well for us. Now remember, you can use the slider like I've just done, or you can go right into the text box and enter a value if you prefer. Then we'll just click and drag into our image. So in other words, depending on what you're working with here, you want to play with those options and those settings until you get your desired effect. If you don't like what you've done, you can do what I just did and undo it in the history panel. There, so now we have completed the color replacement of our handle of our paintbrush. 
thank you. We hope you enjoyed your free video lesson from Teach You Comp Incorporated. Like what you see? Pick up your copy of our complete tutorial today and be sure to visit us at www.teachucomp.com slash YouTube for your special bonus offer. Our complete tutorial featuring introductory through advanced material is available on CD-ROM or digital download. You will receive our high quality video lessons plus printable instruction manuals in one easy to use training package. With over two dozen titles to choose from, you'll be sure to find the training you need in Microsoft Office, QuickBooks, Photoshop, and much more. Visit us today!